All right, Rob, thanks. Well, a major historical site in New Iberia is the Shadows on the Tesh. It features the plantation home of the Weeks family, the largest sugarcane producers on Bayou Tesh. And as Josh Money found out, the plantation serves as a way to address race relations through the power of history. You know, the shadows is important in telling um, the like African American experience and telling the history of New Iberian sort of melding it all together. Shadows on the Tesh might be the perfect place to learn about that experience. Before the Civil War, the plantation housed a large slave population. At the height of the Weeks family's wealth, more than 300 slaves lived on the property. When folks get a guided tour of the Weeks house, the family lived there from 1834 to 1958, the tour encompasses about 125 years of American history from the antebellum period to the early civil rights movement. Historians found more than 1,700 written documents, including invoices, letters, and journals describing the Weeks family's life at Shadows. Because this is a beautiful house, a beautiful home, and we have so much information from the Weeks family, but they're only half of the story, or less than half. The other half of the story comes from the slaves who were forced to work the plantation's land and maintain the property. I personally enjoy um, discussing the relationship of Mary and Louisa Bryant, the enslaved housekeeper, because while Mary and Louisa's children are like fishing in the backyard and playing games, their life is not the same, you know? And at 12, Mary's children go off to boarding school and Louisa's children would be put to work. Shadows on the Tesh still has 85% of its original furniture, allowing the home to look just as it did nearly 200 years ago. And the history stored on that site serves as a gateway to the city's past, a link to antebellum America, the Civil War, Reconstruction, Jim Crow, and the early civil rights movement. In New Iberia, Josh Many, KTC TV3. Our GMA crew is on the road all this week in Iberia Parish. Every day we'll be highlighting the people and places that make Iberia Parish unique. We'll be out there for on the road for cruising Cajun Country Car Show for that. The show gets started at 4.30 Friday morning on GMA.